Nick Jorgens outside, I don't understand him, West Ham fans here with Mitch. Um, another gutless performance, another predictable defeat, yeah. and we're sinking like a ship. Mm -hmm. um, speechless. Thank All you very much then. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm going to see you later. Well, you know what, I probably will be soon after this season. I think that's it for me, the home season. Um, I'll probably just, I'll probably just go out going away games, because this soulless shit fucking stadium drives me to my fucking bone. The, the support was here. A lot of them are actually quite clueless, I think. A lot of them don't come here every week and week out. Um, it's empty most of the time. Um, and I'm, yeah, I've just had enough of the stadium now. I think time's up for me here. I'm, I'm done with it. Um, just a way season ticket next season. Looking forward to that. Um, honestly, I don't know what to say today because I say it every single week. It's just the same old shit. We, um, honestly, I'm going to be compl completely honest. I did want us to lose today. Um, Phone's going off again in this interview again. Can't believe it. Two, two fucking fan cams in a row. Um, I'll have to turn it off next time. Um, so, it's just. So, uh, the, the manager, the manager again, he's making the wrong decisions. He's, you know, the team hasn't, he's obviously not playing for him now. How long do they, we say this every week now, but how long do they give it? Because he should be gone six, seven weeks ago. And we're sitting in our six, seven, eight, nine games yeah. down, the, down the line. And we're sinking like a stone. What, the, what, um, how, how, what does he have to do to get the fucking sack? Well, this is what I want us to lose. A lot of fans, I, I get a lot of stick from my mates, actually. You actually do want us to win every game. Um, I want us to win every oh, game, but... Oh, what's this? Yeah, but... For fuck off, you fucking cunts. Oh, my God, my words from after. Um, uh, fucking hell, prick. Um, all right, let's get rid of him, Pellegrini. Um, because... If we don't, okay, lose. All right, keep fucking pissing me off. All right, so the reason why I want us to lose today is because I'm sick of the death of that guy. He keeps putting up controversial lineups at week in, week out. Tactical decision making, awful. How did today? Sweat today. Why take off the player who's offering quite a lot? And we know two up front works. He knows two up front works because he did that at Southampton. He, even though he's forced to because Anderson got injured and he had to play that thing there. Um, Lanzini. I was playing so much worse than him, so much worse. Um, Fournau has took his goal well. He's been growing a bit. I still personally don't think he's good enough for West Ham. He's growing. Hey, I'm, I'm good enough for fucking West Ham at the minute. Don't tell me. No, no, no. Fournau's ain't. I'd rather you on there. You'd be like the best hold up striker of all time, man. You'd be. I, I'll get I can't you. run. I can't move. Fournau's can't, but at least you've got a bit of strength about you. Okay. Um, yeah, I'd play you attacking midfield. I bet you could ping the balls attacking up. Attacking midfield now, fuck it, hell. Better, honestly, better than four. <laughs> oh, I know what you're saying, mate. Um, can we get out of this scrap? Yes, we can, if that manager goes. I mean, I'll, we say it, I'll say it every single game. It's getting Arsenal fan TV like now, isn't it? Oh, I don't. Oh, mate. I don't like to go that way. But it, it, it is, mate. It is. Um, if that guy ain't gone by tomorrow, then, then we know, obviously we know why. It's just them stupid fucking... Tight. Too tight. Too tight. I mean, apparently, I've heard some sources that if we go in the bottom three, um, we can sack him then and, we won't get, and he won't get the compensation. So apparently... Just give him the compensation. I'd rather give him the compensation course, than not... Of course, of course, but they're not going to do that, are they? Um, and apparently they're going to stay forever now. I mean, they said apparently we, they love at the club, didn't they? They said that in the statement yesterday. We want our kids to take over. They don't love the club. If they love the club, they get rid of him. I, I personally actually do think he might be gone for the next few days, but hopefully he does and... Well, we'll see. We'll see. All right. Cheers, Mitch. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Thank you.